Are there running gait abnormalities associated with running injuries? A 2018 study by Brammer set to examine this exact question. 72 injured runners in 36 controls had their running gait analysed and then compared the two groups. What did they found? They found that injured groups demonstrated greater contralateral pelvic drop and forward trunk lean during mid-stance, and they landed with a more extended knee and dorsiflexed ankle at initial contact. These kinematic patterns were consistent across each of the four injured subgroups they, they checked, including patellofemoral pain, ITB, medial tibial stress, and Achilles tendinopathy. Pelvic drop was found to be the most important variable predicting the classification of participants as healthy or injured. Importantly, for every one degree increase in pelvic drop, there was an 80% increase increase in the odds of being classified as injured. What are the limitations of this research? Well, firstly, this study was done retrospectively, so we can't conclusively say that the changes in running gait caused their injury. The key takeaway here is that running gait analysis should form a part of the holistic approach to running-related injuries.